God bless you. My name is Craig Doyle Henry, and you are watching CDH Live TV. We have a great show for you today. Uh, I want to send a special shout out and thank you to my Ultimate Sacrifice family for uh, all the access behind the scenes. And now we are in the month of July. We are preparing for True Experience 2010. This is the fourth annual concert event and it is going to be a greater experience than ever before. Looking so forward to that. I'm going to bring you some uh, special interviews as we lead up to the event on Friday, July 16th. Starting with today, uh, we have a special uh, interview with uh, Trevor Smith from the Scott Mission. We've been uh, partnering with them for the past three years and they're uh, a dynamic ministry in the heart of downtown Toronto, giving hope to the homeless. So Trevor Smith is going to give us a tour of the facility and then I have a one-on-one, -on -one, one-take interview. So I'm gonna give you guys that and I'll come back with some extra information about True Experience 2010. Talk to you soon. This is the, the women's and children's clothing bank, and then we also have a men's clothing bank on the far side of the building. Okay. And so this is the Sweet Repeats Clothing Boutique. <laughs> so when you give it, we give it away free, so it's basically from your hands right through us back out uh, to the people that need it. Wonderful. Here's the food bank uh, where we make up the grocery bags. So the items on top is what gets put in the bag. So two cans of tuna and the pasta and soups and all the way around and then we package uh, call family packs of flour and rice and cornstarch and beans and pastas and all kinds of <laughs> all kinds of stuff. <laughs> this is the main kitchen uh, the hot steamers big soup pots mm -hmm. <laughs> we serve a lot of meals so we need a lot of uh, Candles and soup pots. Wow. My favorite is the, uh, the whisk. Wow. <laughs> the big ovens. And then we stack the trays in the morning, full of uh, six plates to a tray. And then we slide it by, serve up the, the hot meal, and it goes right out to the table and is served right away. Beautiful. And people can just drop in. Yeah, no questions asked. If you're hungry, be blessed. Okay. Good stuff. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, it's my pleasure to bring to you right here at the Scott Mission, Mr. Trevor Smith. How are you? Great, how are you? You feeling good? Feeling great. You must be because you're doing great work. <laughs> if you could introduce yourself to the CDH Live TV audience, please. I'm Trevor Smith. I'm the manager of volunteers here at the Scott Mission. Great. Now, the Scott Mission is a mission that does a lot of different things. We're up here in the daycare center. Um, can you give us a short uh, explanation of where the Scott Mission got started and how it uh, has evolved to where it is now? Originally it was a pres Presbyterian ministry that focused on the Jewish population and then it evolved in 1941 we had a major shift and it focused on all people and all backgrounds of life and uh, became what we are today. Yes. So now what we are today, give us a, a clearer picture of what we are today because a lot of people think just, you know, homeless shelter or maybe hot meals. What are the different facets of the Scott Mission today? We have a child care center, we have a camp and youth program, men's ministry and women and family are the main uh, programs. And so in that there's uh, the summer camp up in Caledon, after school clubs uh, in Lawrence Heights, there's uh, hot meals, food bank, clothing banks, showers, laundry facilities, budgeting, Bible studies, etc. Wow. <laughs> so there's a lot going on. There's a lot. Now, being the uh, volunteer manager, how do you how do you find the logistics of you know working with volunteers for all these different aspects of ministry? Um, well, we have lots of volunteers, and praise God that we do um, that we have the help. Um, it's tricky. Now, we have just under 6,000 volunteers, wow. so it's, it keeps me out of trouble <laughs> 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 yeah. to keep everyone in place, but it's a real delight to, yeah. uh, to work with people who want to help. It's awesome. Okay. So how did you, did you start, when you started with the Scott Mission, were you in the same role or did you uh, have other positions as well? How I, did you get started? How did I get started here? Yes. 
I uh, cried out to God. I was on my farm and said, Lord, put me where you want me. And he brought me to downtown Toronto and uh, placed me in uh, the public relations office. Okay. And uh, then it evolved into the volunteer uh, management position. Okay, good. And in the time that you've been here, uh, what sticks out in your mind is, uh, you know, very strong story of, of people that have come through and been affected by the Scott Mission? Uh, the main story that I see constantly is whenever anybody comes in here, uh, you come here because you're in need or you're in distress, everyone who comes in here, uh, their needs are met or we're, we find out who can meet those needs and we direct them. So they come in here um, sad and, uh, and uh, heavy and, and distressed and they always leave uh, positive, upbeat, they get prayed for, they get their needs met, they get uh, food, the clothing, or if it's uh, other special needs, we find out who can meet those specific needs and we direct them to them. Right. So they leave uh, uplifted and then we also see God moving here. We see uh, miraculous healings, we see uh, lives being changed, like true transformation of lives. We see uh, hearts mended, um, we see yeah. lots, we see yeah. lots. <laughs> so there's, there's so much happening and we have such a little time. If people wanted to find out more about what's happening or they wanted to get involved in the work here, how can they, uh, how can they get in, in touch with the Scott Mission to do that? Uh, the website's a great way, www.scottmission.com, or uh, they can call 905-683-905. Uh, <laughs> yes. That's my phone number, 416-923-8872. There you go, and we'll make sure that number is listed right here. So, uh, or you can call me at just home. Just call you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Man, it's, it's, it's really a pleasure every time uh, I come to the Scott Mission to see, and everyone that I've interacted with, the love of Christ is just emanating from this place. Everyone that, that, we, that we speak with and everyone we see is just, you know, filled with that. Uh, how do you find it when you, uh, when you see so much, so much negativity outside, you know, how important is the love of Christ in the, in the mission of the Scott Mission? It's an absolute must. You have to know it yourself, the love of Christ, and then we get to share it out. And so people have asked me, uh, how can you work in a place with so much need in it? And I said, uh, because we get to be the ones who fix it. Uh, this, is, this is the fun side. Yeah. <laughs> this is good. We love it. And so we experience the love of Christ, and then we get to share it out in practical, tangible ways. Mm -hmm. And that's our heart, to see people's practical needs met, but their ultimate need uh, to salvation and getting them to heaven. We want all party in heaven. That's our goal. Yeah. <laughs> Absolutely. Well, thank you again for coming on CDH Live TV. And unfortunately, this is a short interview, but the good news is you can get more information. I'll give you more uh, information on the uh, flip side. And thank you again, Trevor Smith. My pleasure. All right. That's CDH Live TV. Talk to you guys soon. Thank you again, Trevor Smith, for that uh, one-take interview. And for uh, those of you who want more information about getting involved with the Scott Mission, the information is right down here, thescottmission.com. You can go log in to get more information. And of course, uh, Trevor will be doing a special presentation at True Experience 2010, Friday, July 16th. And we're doing something special. We want to go uh, an extra step this year. So for everyone who brings in at least two non-perishable items for the food bank at the Scott Mission, you will get a, a copy of the uh, CDH Live CD. Uh, of the, you'll get a free CD at the concert. Concert. So bring that out Friday, July 16th. We look forward to seeing you there. And time is running out, so get your tickets now. This is going to be a sold-out event this year, and we don't want you to be left out. Get your tickets now. Go to cdhlive.com. And of course, as always, if you have any questions, thoughts, or suggestions, email me, info at cdhlive.com. I would love to hear from you. And until then... Stay blessed, stay true, continue to live life abundantly. My name is Craig Doyle Henry, and this has been CDH Live TV. God bless.